Yay. Battle pass that I'm not gonna buy. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Don't I get free primos for downloading? Okay. Yes! 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 Give me my furniture! Okay, 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 okay. Give me my teapot. I want my teapot. Let's go! Frames are killing themselves. Thank you. I'm back, Granny. It is. Oh, I don't believe we've met. Ah, allow me to do the honors. This child here is Yen Fei. She's the one helping run some errands for me. I've gotten a hold of most of the stuff you asked for, except for Smaragdus Jadeite. I couldn't find any at all. The chasm's been sealed off, and there's just no way in. Couldn't secure any documentation either. <sighs> Looks like the Ministry of Civil Affairs is serious about keeping it strictly locked down. Is that so? Hmm. But Smaragdus Jadeite is really rather essential. Yes. Yenfei, are you sure you can't find some other way? They have helped Leela greatly, after all. It is only right that they are duly rewarded. Hmm. Hold on a moment. Let me have a look. It's a really thick book. What kind of things do you write in there? Commercial consultancy. Or, or, Snezhnaya. Ah, found him. Krussel. A Snezhnayan merchant who once came to me with some legal queries on certain articles in the legal codices. If my memory serves, all of them had to do with rare ores. He mentioned that he was considering acquiring some Smaragdus Jadeite to make hairpins, and wanted to know if there were any legal ramifications that he should be aware of. Said he was planning to sell them in Snezhnaya. So, I guess I'll go look for him. With any luck, he'll have gotten his hands on some Smaragdus Jadeite, or might have an idea of where we can find some. Oh, you want to join me? I suppose that's no problem, but it's best if you just stand by and watch. If you try to get involved, you'll only risk placing yourself in legal jeopardy. Wow, an adeptus imploring us to avoid incurring legal liability. That's a first for sure. But best we be a little more careful than usual while we're with her. Hello, Mr. Crossel. How's business been? Oh, good, very good. All thanks to your advice, Miss Yanfei. What brings you here today? <laughs> You're too kind. I was simply doing my job. Now. I believe that the last time we met, you mentioned that you were looking to source some Smaragdus Jadeite to make hairpins. Have there been any further developments on this front? Uh, well, yes. As a matter of fact, uh, in the end, I did acquire a small piece of Smaragdus Jadeite and had it fashioned into a pair of hairpins. Miss Yanfei, might I presume that you have an interest in the hairpins? I must apologize. I have already rented them out to a lady named Zhe Chiao. If you'd like to inspect them, you may have to wait quite some time. Wait! Isn't Smaragdus Jadeite really rare? Aren't you worried about the hairpins getting damaged or lost while they're being rented out? No, I'm not worried in the slightest, because I signed a contract with Miss Zhu Chiao before renting them to her. The contract makes it quite clear that if she loses or damages the item in question, she must compensate me for its full original value. In return, I included a clause that guarantees the Smaragdus Jadeite is genuine, with a penalty of ten times the item's value payable by me to Miss Zhu Chiao in the event that it is shown to be a fake. Oh, whatever shall I do? Y yes that's me. Is there something I can help you with? How do you do, Miss Zhu Chao? We understand from Mr. Crossel that you recently rented a pair of hairpins from him. My associates and I are very interested in them. Would you mind letting us take a look at them? The hairpins? 
I can't lend them to you right now. I... I've lost them. But could I borrow the processing record? Now, could you let me borrow this document? Let's go to Boo Boo Pharmacy to speak with Dr. Bai. The weirdo with the snake around his neck? What do you want to speak to him man. for? I suppose that you're about to ask me to write an official affidavit attesting to the pharmaceutical peculiarities of Smaragdus Jadeite? Nice. Like that snake, is indeed the case. Snake, if you would be so kind, Dr. Baizu. No trouble at all. It's just a single document. Won't take me a moment. I would mention, though, that you are not the only one who's developed a curiosity for Smaragdus Jadeite recently. A Snezhnayan merchant came to ask me about it not long ago. But after I gave him my reply, his expression shifted to one of remarkable disappointment. I wonder, Miss Yenfei, if your pressing business might be related to the Snezhnayan merchant? Ah, you needn't concern yourself about that, Dr. Baizhu. Thank you for penning us that document. I'll make sure to compensate you in due course. You're too kind. Take care now. Well, we have the evidence we need. Let's go find Mr. Crossel. Goodbye. I don't want to speak with you. Miss Yanfei, have you finished your investigation? I trust you will now be in a position to assess the compensation due. Yes, my investigation is indeed concluded. I can now provide a final figure for the amount payable. Wonderful. Well then, please, could you do the honors, Miss Yanfei? Of course. Ahem, <clears throat> according to the stipulations of the contract. Mr. Crossel, you must pay Mr. Chow ten times the original transaction price in Mora. Sure. Wait, what? M me pay her? Surely there's been some kind of mistake, Miss Yanfei. Not at all. According to my investigations and the material evidence that we've gathered, the substance claimed to be Smaragdus Jadeite that was inlaid within the Smaragdus Jadeite twin phoenix pins that you rented out to Mr. Chow was, in fact, Smaragdus Nephrite. Now, the contract states very clearly that ten times the price shall be paid should the article not be genuine. Accordingly, you are liable for this sum, which is payable to Mr. Chow in Mora. Material evidence? What material evidence? Why, Miss Yanfei, you cannot frame me like this! I spent a huge sum to obtain that Sparagdus Jadeite, and yet you claim that the ore inlaid on the hairpins is somehow fake? I demand to see your evidence. Indeed. Only a testimony from an expert witness involved in the processing of the ore can serve as an authoritative assessment of whether it is genuine. Traveler, please produce the evidence in question. This is a processing record from the Jade Mystery, along with stone samples and an affidavit signed by the business owner, Chateau. Seriously? Even the boss there couldn't differentiate between Smaragdus Jadeite and Smaragdus Nephrite. How does this prove anything? In any case, Smaragdus Nephrite is the outer layer of Smaragdus Jadeite. So I had him cut away the Nephrite, he returned the valuable Jadeite core to me, and some Nephrite samples remain in the store. What am I missing exactly? Th that's an unsubstantiated belief. Well, your claim that my ore is fake is just as unsubstantiated. And we are here to talk about evidence, aren't we? Ugh. Looks like our first piece of evidence didn't convince him at all. Seems like he came prepared. What should we do next? Hard evidence. Something legally binding. We have just the thing. Show him, Traveler. Oh, come on. I meant the backup copy of the document from the Ministry of Civil Affairs. The w <laughs> This document proves that my hairpins are the real deal, doesn't it? This is the Ministry's seal, after all. It shows that the ore inlaid on the pins is indeed Smaragdus Jadeite. Our second piece of evidence didn't work either. And this guy's getting more belligerent by the second. Hmm. You know, you could be right. Perhaps the hairpins are the real deal after all. Of course I'm right. All the evidence shown supports my story. Well, hang on a moment now, because I do recall one final piece of evidence that we haven't revealed yet. Traveler, would you do the honors? Well, 
What's this? Smaragdus Jadeite springs forth from Stone Marrow within the mountains and will bring disaster to any mere mortals who touch it. Sustained contact with Smaragdus Jadeite over a prolonged period will, in less serious cases, cause a mild malady, while in serious cases, the patient may suffer a dramatic change of personality and fall seriously ill. Mr. Crossel, were you aware of these peculiar properties of Smaragdus Jadeite? I... I had no idea. No idea, you say? Hmm, I'd guessed as much. But for you to have rented out such a dangerous item... I'm afraid that this falls outside the scope of my work, but within that of the Ministry of Civil Affairs. However, I'm sure that the Ministry will be relatively lenient, considering that, as you say, you were ignorant of the danger you posed. Don't worry, Mr. Crossel. I will make sure that all the evidence presented here will be handed over to the Ministry. I trust that you'll give them your full cooperation in their investigations. What? Wait, wait! I... <sighs> I knew. You do understand, Mr. Crossel, that this means that you will have to pay Ms. Sir Chow ten times the original price in Mora? Mr. Crossel, your answer, please. My client and I are waiting. I... 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 I admit it. I confess. The ore I had and laid on those hairpins was... was Maragdus Nephrite. But I'm a victim in all of this, too. I invested a great deal of time and money into acquiring that small amount of Sparagdus Jadeite in the hopes of turning it into a piece of jewelry that would fetch a fine price. Is it Yen Fei? <gasps> no, fucking Diana. <gasps> Diana? <gasps> Diana. <laughs> That's good. I don't want her. She's ice. I have ice. But she's a shield ice. <laughs> worried that someone would see through it which is why i only Ooh, dared to rent them out not can. sell them and then to top it all off jichao lost the hairpins after i rented them out to her exactly if they weren't the real deal why'd you make her pay so much hmm? i i didn't want to either but when i purchased that smaragdus jadeite some of my no business money. partners found out i knew they'd be watching closely to see how much i could make off it this. If word got out that I sold a pair of fake hairpins, then my days in this line of business would be over. All right, okay. let's cut the appeals phase right there. I fail to see what bearing any of this has on your transaction with my client. According to the contract, you must pay Mr. Chow ten times the original price in Mora, and that is final. Mister. She said Mr. Ten times. Oh, we just killed a man. Even if the Smaragdus jaded on those hairpins was fake, I still bear responsibility for losing them. Legally or not, I think I owe some compensation for that. Uh, Ms. Okay. Jichou, you... <clears throat> However, Mr. Crossel, Are you going? since you have no use for that chunk Hello. of Smaragdus jadeite, why don't you give it to me instead? What? But I... All right, then. This cursed rock's brought me enough grief as it is. Miss Yenfei... I'll turn this Maragdus Jadeite over to you. I trust that it will suffice as remuneration? Well, um, that's not quite how the rules say this should go. But whatever, it'll do. Were you able to find the Smaragdus Jadeite? Good, good. Then we have all the materials we need. Well, if we're all set, Granny, I'll get going now. Got a ton of clients waiting for me back at the office. Oh, you. All right, then. Go see to your business. Granny should be able to handle the rest. I'm off, then. Bye! Oh, yes, Traveler. Make sure you don't lose the business card I gave you. I've been looking into the laws of other nations as well. If you should ever bump into any trouble with the law, come find me directly. Regulars get discounts, too. Come now, child. Are you leaving or are you not? If you have no wish to leave, perhaps you'd like to help me clean my teapot, hmm? <laughs> I'm leaving! I'm leaving! It's time for the temple. The pain. You gotta do two kills. Really? Yeah. A book. Trash. 
Oh. Oh. Garbage. And here's the pain. Ooh. Oh. You get another D. <gasps> A book. Boy, I'm gonna. <clears throat> oh. I mean. Oh. <laughs> You see, two purples and one. Two purples and one. It's the Gigi one. I want this. I want this. Oh, see, look, you just got more. Oh wait, is mine done? Oh wait, I gotta finish my quest and then I'll do my rolls, okay? It is but a single teapot. It shan't take long at all. Just wait here for a moment. Not even that good, bro. Look at Chichi. I got it. There we go. This serenity pot. Serenity pot. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. I'm going to roll after I get this pot. Certain little helper to await you within this teapot. She will explain everything you need to know about it. Yes, I got the teapot. Which one should I pick? Floating abode, Emerald Peak, or Cool Isle? I like Cool Isle. Because it's a beach. Is there more pictures? Is it just water? This one's pretty and all, but there's too many floating spots. Like house here, house here, house here. This one's also the same. I'll try Cool Isles. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh my God. Can I pick oh. all of them? Oh. Everything. Dude, I'm, my ear itches now. Bro, shut the fuck up, Fiona. You fucking asshole. <laughs> are they not gonna pity me? They are. I don't know how you check, but. No. Okay, they're not gonna pity me because they're fucking ass. Bitches, and they can go suck my ass. Fucking fuck you guys and ho yo yo or whatever it's called. <laughs> Me oh. ho yo yo. <laughs> Dude, what am I supposed to do now? I'm useless. Oh yeah. This teapot seems even bigger inside the Metal King. Yeah. There's even a great big house in the middle too. Huh. But there's just oh a whole God. load of nothing around it. I have no more. Uh, I might can't do poor. that. Uh, well, you're the one with the sword anyway. You can do it. Still, why is it so empty here apart from that house? Oh, wait a second. I what is that? No more. I'm not happy. I have one five-star character, and I'm yeah. tired, and I haven't done my homework yet, and I spent money. Okay. Oh, wait, what? what? Oh my god, I'm so surprised. What? <laughs> I look at my primo gems. I didn't know I had this many. How much is it? Can you, are you not watching? No. Damn, that's a lot. All right. Why, if you <laughs> I won't. I'm I'm look, gonna kill myself. I won't. 
Because I already got child, so that means my pity is super low. See, look. And live each day to the I'm not going to get him. Uh, I'll that start off with a 10 pool. I, I'll probably get a- I'm gonna get a- <gasps> It's gonna be a weapon. It's gonna be a weapon. It's- It's gonna be a weapon. I promise you. I promise you it's a weapon. I did- I didn't do anything. It's gonna be a weapon. I literally have saved for- Yen- Yen Fei! Yes! Okay. It's my first pull. It's my first pull. Oh my god. My luck is insane. Oh. Oh. Oh my god. Did my. Oh. Oh my fuck. Holy fuck. Oh. I'll review the house another time. I need. Oh. Oh.